when you begin your exam, you want to start in the aorta. Okay, here's a clip showing the, the color flow in the aorta. You want to take grayscale images, color images, and uh, spectral wave analysis. You can see a nice aorta waveform. It's at 138 centimeters per second. Um, you want to make sure your scales are set correct. Here, see it's aliasing. That's not a good scale. Or if it's too low also, you, uh, that's not a good scale. So sweep speed and scale, you want to make sure that they're set correctly. Okay, after you finish your uh, aorta, you go to the IVC, proximal. You see right here going into the right atrium. Here you can see the right renal artery behind the IVC. And there's going to be a phasic phasicity in the, the waveform of the IVC as the patient breathes. Okay, so then you go to the renal arteries. Now there's two approaches for the renal arteries. That's anterior. So you're scanning right in the anterior part of the abdomen. Um, if they're very gassy, you're going to have a hard time. Sometimes you might have to push a little hard to displace the gases laterally. And here's a transverse image. You can see the superior mesenteric artery, the aorta, right renal artery. IVC here is kind of collapsed, but you see how the right renal artery courses behind the IVC. And the SMV, this is pancreas. And here's a colored Doppler uh, image. Here's your aorta, right renal artery, left renal artery. It's uh, color encoded in blue because it's... So this blood flow is going away from your transducer face, so it's going to be color coded in blue. Um, if you angle the transducer, you'll be able to pick it up in red. Here is a color, a power Doppler view of the same arteries. Aorta, left renal artery, right renal artery, and then this is a, the left renal vein. You can see this is SMA, so the left renal vein courses between the aorta and the SMA. All right, here's another view of the right renal artery posterior to the IVC. That's very important. Uh, this view, you can even see if there's, if there's multiple renal arteries, you'll see more than uh, one circle. And here's what's with Doppler. And uh, if you're having a hard time getting the, the anterior approach, the, the vessel and longitudinal, you can go to the IVC, find your right renal artery behind it, and then and then turn 90 degrees and you will see the right renal artery in longitude here's a, a clip of that showing that 90 degrees and boom there's your right renal artery with the right renal vein so that's a a, a, a neat trick okay so if you're scanning your arteries through the anterior approach you can use angles depending on where your you know if you put the doppler here you're not going to pick up any uh any signal because that's like 90 degrees to the beam you pick up some so you want to, to to angle your transducer or have the patient turn over here the, the arteries are dipping away so i'm at a 45 degree angle and you're getting a nice clean spectral waveform nice spectral window 133 centimeters per second here's another view i've angled uh more to the left and i'm getting the the vessel and the artery and the vein in longitudinal and then this is at the hilum, right renal vein, right renal artery. Next, the coronal approach, you'll see what they call the banana peel sign because it looks like a, you know, banana peeled, peeled open. So if you're approaching from the right side, this vessel is going to be the right uh, renal artery. And this is the left renal artery. It's blue because the blood flow is going away from the transducer. And here they're labeled right renal artery, left renal artery, and then this is IVC. This is liver. Okay, so flank approach, coronally, you can see the vessel completely. This is renal tissue here, and this is the right renal artery. You can see it all the way through. So if there's any aliasing, you'll be able to see it there. If there's an actual stenosis, you'll be able to see it. And another view here, coronally, you can see the vessel completely. And uh, right here, you can see it superimposed on the right renal vein. So these are nice views. Um, and then uh, if you're doing a flank approach, you really don't have to do an angle because... Zero degrees is the best angle for your Doppler. And and this and these images, you will be zero degrees or a little off. And this image, you can tell I'm not zero degrees, but this is a 45 degree angle here. And this is probably like 30 degrees. So that's a pretty good angle. You don't need a, uh, to put an angle on your sample volume. And you get a nice clean tracing right here. You have a very uh, sharp upstroke, systolic upstroke, and your dichrotic notch. And then a lot of diastole. Okay, so next you want to do renal veins. Um, this is like a coronal view. On the right, you have uh, the right renal vein and the IVC. 
on transverse, here is the both vessels at the hilum, renal artery and renal vein. And this is with color Doppler. Here you see a nice view going into the, the right kidney and IVC. And then Dopplering also with uh, you know phasicity as is normally seen in these vessels. Um, like the renal artery and everything else, you always want grayscale, color Doppler, and uh, pulse wave Doppler images. All right, so now to the intrarenal vessels. The AIUM protocol says that you got to do the segmentals in the superior, mid, and inferior poles of the kidney. You know, there's always going to be some variability and from uh, from institution to institution. Some places want both. So here, this is a Doppler with a segmental. And a ni very nice waveform, 70 uh, centimeters per second. Uh, the resistive index is 0 0.65, that's normal. And then as you go further up the cortex, your velocity is going to be lower because the arteries are smaller. Uh, here, the arcuate is nice and 21 centimeters per second. Resistive index, 0 0.59. Okay, so when you're doing these uh, protocols, you also want to do grayscale images of the both kidneys, you know, to check for... Uh, renal asymmetry to see if there's any masses or cysts or um, any uh, increased echogenicities or anything like that. Mm -hmm.